Hello crafters, this is Suzanne from A Creative Muse and I'm here with a new Adornit recipe stamp of the month just in time for Easter and also this is my Saturday morning makes. I haven't done one in a long time. Saturday morning makes is an online craft sharing event hosted by Jill Norwood of Greenwood Girl Cards. I just received this set of goodies. This is a recipe stamp of the month. This is called the Carrot Cake Muffin. And all these stamps that I'm going to show you now are already available in the Adornit shop. Yay! For those of you that did not join the recipe stamp of the month or the add-on, these are available for individual purchase right now. So the recipe stamp of the month is carrot cake muffins. Love! Love the big bowl with the recipe and then the cute little bunnies. This measures five inches wide by three and a half inch tall. You get the sentiment, happy Easter and a carrot. Love this. I did make an example. Need to finish up right down here. Need to add grass or something. I used a waffle flower die to cut out this image. This is called the A2 Lacy Layers. I used the outer piece and then I added that little bow. This topper bow comes from this fabulous picket fence set called a bow for any reason die set. Love this. I think that's great just to highlight this. Then these flowers, so much fun. Pretty Pink Posh. This is their spring mug add-ons. So they have that winter mug die set that you can then add on a bunch of goodies with all different seasons and different occasions. There's even a graduation mug. So this is a spring one. I thought this was so cute. I started off with that winter mug. There's a, so many great examples of this. So this makes little tulip and then the daisy super cute set 17 dies for this one you even get the little honey dipper too and then i have some doodle bug cardstock in the back that's one of their big 12 by 12 packs of papers so look at that carrot muffin colored up with my copic markers no actually not copic these are colored up actually with olo markers which surprisingly was not bleeding last night it was doing good this is on nina 110 pound cardstock up next this is the add-on Easter bunches. Look at the little bunny holding all the carrots and then here peeking beyond a carrot. <laughs> I love that. There is carrot, love your bunches, Easter, and then a carrot bouquet. So fun. Let me do a measurement on this cutie patootie. Three and a quarter inch going all the way up there wide by a little bit over two and a half inch tall. Okay. So super cute. So that's available right now. I love that. And then there is the Easter pickup stamp. This is the big one, six by eight inch. These are all high quality photopolymer stamps. They stamp very well. I'm using Memento Tuxedo Black ink. There's this pickup. There's some peeking bunnies. The whole bunny riding on a carrot with flowers. I love this little, little ladybug. A sentiment. Happy Easter. Happy spring. Look forward to the joy they bring. A bouquet and more carrots. Let me give you a measurement of the truck. Four inches tall by three and a half inch wide. I did color it up. Here it is. Look at that. Isn't that cute? This now is Copic marker. So you can see the difference here with the Olo and the Copic. It's about the same. And I use some E50 markers for my bunnies here. And for this scallop detail, I'm using the same A2 lacy layers from Waffle Flower. This die in here to cut that out. And then the other image was a stitched one with the same rectangle, okay? This is a fabulous set. My little bunny. And then I'm going to make a whole thing for a mini album that I need to start making. Also in this new Easter release, there is the Easter Church stamp. Let me give you a measurement on this dome Easter church scene. Four and a quarter inch tall by three and three quarters of an inch wide. Isn't this pretty and so scenic? We have the little lambs, the church, the whole scene for Easter at church. And then here is the happy Easter. There's some flowers. And then here is like the same style. So because of Easter, our hearts are full of joy and we can rejoice. Love that. Easter church. I also purchased two items myself a la carte. I had this one before, which is called Deviled Eggs. This might be one you want to take a look at because this is available in wood stamp and it sells for a whole lot in wood stamp. But this is Deviled Eggs and then you get this lovely recipe. Look at the bunny, full size, five inches tall by three and three quarters of an inch wide, okay? I got the bunny faces. This is also a stamp set that is sold individually, like individual wood block, individual wood block. A lot of money for this one. So I'm glad that they have it in the bunny faces at Adornit. Under three inches tall, 
about three inches wide. The female bunny and the male bunny, these are so cute. So I was so happy that they had this in stock and I finally got it. I even got the snowman faces too. There is a gingerbread face as well. I have that in my stash too, but this is new to my stash. And these are in stock, so love. So everything will be detailed and linked below what I showed you. Look at all these goodies. I'm so happy that these are available right now for you. So you can get them and they do ship quickly and have them in time for Easter. Look at that carrot cake muffins and everything else. Okay, crafters, until the next video, check out all this Easter bunny cuteness and goodness at Adorn It. Stay crafty, my friends. Bye.